What's cracking guys, Razor Vasquez back with a budget microphone video. I have four budget microphones or kind of lower end microphones. I'm using my main mic, the newer 800. I have a $1 lavalier mic. I have my pair of Razor Krakens and then a pair of Skull Candy Inked earbuds, that is, with an inline mic. This is kind of a range of cheaper audio sources that you can get you can pick everything up for under a hundred dollars the most expensive thing is the pair of razor krakens however that is a gaming headset which i do recommend if you're on a budget everything will be listed and linked in the description if you want to look at it or maybe even purchase it i'm going to be two different i'm going to do two different tests one is i'm going to read some video game quotes they're going to be the exact same quotes within the microphones and then I'm going to be playing a song. The song is from about 45 to 55 decibels from where I'm sitting. Um, this is going to be a decent representation of heavy, heavy background noise. Um, to give you a reference, 60 decibels is about a normal conversation from three feet from each other. So if you're talking with another person, you're hearing their voice at 60 decibels. So this is really good for kind of conventions where a lot of people are talking, even though it may get louder, or maybe where uh, light music is being played, or maybe if you're even streaming and you have your music external instead of internal. For some strange reason, it never sounds as good, but I've seen people who have done that way just to kind of have music in there. So starting with the newer 800, these are the gaming quotes. It's, our na it's in our nature to forget the truths that keep us awake at night, Fallout New Vegas. We all make choices, but in the end, our choices make us. Bioshock. Wanting something does not give you the right to have it, Assassin's Creed 2. Knowledge is useless if it is not used, Good Wars 2. This test, the next test at least, is um, the, uh, the music test. Again, it's playing from about 45 to 55 decibels, and I'll be completely silent. This is just showing you that if it picks up the music even more, that means it handles background noise a lot less. If it picks it up less, that means it handles background noise a lot more. However, I think the uh, newer 800 is going to do best because it's a cardioid mic that I'm going to be holding straight up and away from my face. I'm going to hold all the microphones like this in a similar position so I can get similar results. So that was the test, that was about 20 seconds of audio, and I'm doing no post. So normally I do um, kind of a, a noise reduction, which cuts out the digital noise. However, since this is a budget um, kind of microphone, most of you don't have a DAC, and most of you, at least some of you at least, don't know how actually how to use some editing software like Audacity, which is really easy to learn, but for some strange reason, if you don't, this is just what the uh, a similar sound quality you're going to get if you were just to hook this straight up to a uh, full desktop PE PC. I know laptops are a little different because their um, auxiliary for headphones do not get as much energy, so this is kind of a better case scenario for the microphone. This is recording off the $1 lavalier mic and holy shit turn down your audio because it is it is fucking loud. I can see about the waveforms already. Turn down your microphone before I do these tests. Notice that there is a shit ton of echo. I've personally experienced this. Um, this is the $1 lavalier mic. This is the cheapest mic of the bunch and I am holding this a similar distance that I hold my normal microphone which is about two inches, two and a half inches from my face. So these are the gaming quotes. It's in our nature to want to forget our truths that keep us awake at night. Fallout. We all make choices but in the end our choices make us. Bioshock. Wanting something does not give you the right to have it, Assassin's Creed 2, and Knowledge is useless if it is not used, Guild Wars 2. <laughs> As you see, there is a, a ton of echo, and I'm not surprised that this isn't going to handle background noise correct or uh, any good. So this is the background noise, um, again playing at the same volume and a similar part of the song.
So as you notice, it picks up background noise a lot, and there is a huge amount of echo, and it picks up little noise, little noises very well. So I'm gonna go tap my fingers on my table just to kind of give you what would be actually really silent on other microphones is overblown with this microphone. So this is less than less than acceptable in my opinion, especially if you are going to do things that require lavaliers, such as doing um, reviews of stuff. It just does not sound good. You're going to pick up a lot of echo. I would recommend if you have a newer camera, use the microphone on your camera and then just forget the lavalier. However, if you're in a wide open space, um, the best case scenario, this will sound decent enough. And for about $2.50, including shipping, it's not that bad of a deal if you have nothing else to uh, communicate with viewers with. These are the Razor Kraken Pros held at about um, microphone distance. The microphone is about half an inch from my face. Um, it is quite a bit loud stock, so there is less echo, but there is still a little bit of echo, and you get that kind of gaming headset sound signature where everything's a little muffled. However, for 60 bucks, 70 bucks, they are not a really bad pair of headphones. Um, I am using the included uh, cable that splits for Razer, if that makes any difference, which it probably does not. So these are the video game quotes. It is in our nature to want to forget truths that keep us awake at night. We all make choices, but in the end, our choices make us. Wanting something does not give you the right to have it. And, knowledge is useless if it is not used. So these sound so much better than the $1 microphone. So if you are uh, doing voiceovers or anything and you're on a medium range budget, these are your best friend. However, for $25, the newer, you're probably going to get the best sound out of them. This is the background noise of the same part of the song. So these do still pick up quite a bit of background noise, however it is a much higher quality background noise which uh, if there's music playing around and you're streaming this will sound so much better to your viewers than that $1 microphone. However it's not very high quality and I am playing them off a good speaker to kind of prevent any bad audio. So uh, these are really good for what you get and if you're beginning PC gaming these are really good for things like Skype and, and such. Plug and play. If your uh, desktop or laptop has two splitters, then uh, you're good to go. However, if it has a headphone microphone jack combo, these will work without the splitter, which is nice, but it does require a little bit more power, and you do get a little bit more digital noise in between. These are the Skull Candy earbuds. These are catered to more people who... Um, if you don't want to do a lot of YouTubing, however, if you want to make a quick either phone call or use these as your main uh, party chat headset, which I do on Xbox, which is going to be really nice because I've never heard the sound quality of the microphone. These are my main Xbox uh, microphone and uh, kind of earbud combo just because how, it is, how easy it is to carry them and I can use them for things like music on my phone or computer just plug it in and plug it back in. However, if you do want to use these on a computer, you either need to have a headphone microphone jack combo or a splitter. I'm using the same splitter as my Razer Krakens to uh, record this. So let's go through the gaming quotes. It is in our nature to want to forget truths that keep us awake at night. We all make choices, but in the end, our choices make us. Wanting something does not give you the right to have it, and knowledge is useless if it is not used. So, decent, better than the $1 microphone, and about the same size. If you want to do some quick recording, these are much better. Even though you're going to see the earbuds if you if you kind of wear them on your ear, but if you MacGyver something with the microphone, you can use this as a better lav mic. The one thing about the lav mic, it is compatible with phones, but not with all phones. Earbuds like these are compatible with most phones. 
phones are really good for kind of budget microphone recording um, the only thing is is you need to sync it up uh, later with your video if you ever took some however I think these are a step up to lower end video camera microphones by a good margin but if you do have a more expensive camera say a thousand or kind of two thousand dollar DSLR why the fuck are you buying uh, cheap audio then but you may want to keep the uh, audio of the more expensive camera because it will sound a little bit better however it will have a little bit more echo so this is the sound of the background noise So it does pick it up and holy shit, the microphone does auto readjust itself to uh, make sure that um, the audio is not overblown. So when I was just talking, it was still adjusting. So if you have loud music playing around everywhere, it will adjust itself um, to kind of pick up more music or to pick up more noise or to cancel out more noise. So if you're in a loud place, it might reduce it a little bit and then say if you move out of that place your audio is going to just be blown up for a few seconds like mine was for a second. However, these are not that bad. Um, definitely suboptimal, especially if uh, you're going to around busy places. However, these are just easier to use than the lavalier mic and sometimes cleaner to use. It does sound better. These are about 15, 20 bucks and you can get them anywhere. Um, there are better earbuds that sound a lot better so if you want to pay about 50 60 70 dollars for your earbuds you are going to get a better microphone however so just kind of keep that in mind these are lower end uh, earbuds however they do sound amazing if you want to know the sound quality for some strange reason so i hope you guys enjoyed and one easy thing to make sure that your audio sounds better with almost everything is to have a DAC i believe one is called the phantom uh, power supply which is recommended for the newer 800 this is why my audio sounds so quiet. I do have to increase the volume of it because it is not getting enough power. That's why you also hear a lot of digital noise if I do not do the noise reduction like I did now. You may have heard it earlier in the video uh, with the newer 800 in the beginning. Um, so noise reduction is key if you don't have a DAC and the uh, Phantom Power Supply like with everything else will be listed and linked down below for your convenience because I'm just that nice. I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope you guys learned uh, a few things about using budget microphones and the background noise they have and kind of how cancerous that $1 lavalier mic was. It is borderline unuseless. If you don't have anything else to communicate with your, uh, with your audience, then by all means use it, but just find something a little bit better. Even picking up a pair of Skull Candy earbuds from say Walmart will even sound better, look better, and they have multi-purpose and you'll be able to use them on more phones. Um, the lavalier mic works on my new phone, however it does not work on my old phone. So if you have an older phone or a um, slower phone or just a random phone, it may not work with your phone. It may not pick up the microphone and it may pick up your phone's microphone. However, that is a viable microphone too. Um, phone microphones tend to be decent, so if you want to use that, say if you're out and about and you want to uh, record some kind of new audio if you have a newer phone they do sound really good so if you have say a HTC M8 9 or 10 an iPhone the iPhone 6 and above do have really good microphones or the uh, Samsung S6 7 and then the Note do have pretty good microphones so I hope you guys enjoyed I hope you guys learned a thing about budget audio like I just said I'll see you in the next one